Hey guys, VC Coins Nevada here. Getting ready to pour me a channel bar or two, depending on how much silver I have left. Uh, but this first one's gonna be for uh, Silver Madness. He ordered a bar from me. He's been waiting, so I wanna get this done. And I appreciate him being patient. But here we go, we're gonna pour a channel bar here. It's gonna be a two ounce bar. Ooh good lord, that's hot. That mold is super heated. Here we go. There's our first one. Very nice. Close that lid. That's going to be a chunky bar. I think it's going to be well over two ounces for sure. For Silver Madness. So we'll let this thing. It's very shiny. Nice. Good silver. It's 999 silver. Flip that over. It's got a little bit of a, a beaver's tail on it on the end of it. That's no big deal. That'll pop right off. So let me turn this thing around here. See if we can get another one out of there. I'm not sure if we can or not. Uh, let's see what we got here. What we got left in here. We might get a one ounce a little over a one ounce bar in here. I'm not sure if we're gonna get another two ounces or not. No, we're not. I can tell by looking. We might get another one ounce out of here. We'll see. Yeah, we're not gonna even get, oh, look at the spillover. I didn't think so. So all that little bit of silver splash over, it'll go back in for a remelting on something else. But we did get a good bar for Silver Madness. We'll let that, we'll put, actually we'll drop it in the water. There we go. Take these gloves off real quick. Not gonna touch that yet. We'll remelt all that stuff. Yeah, it's just a little bit of a piece on here that's in the way. There we go. And I'll clean that up for them. And Silver Madness. That turned out pretty cool, my friend. There you go. Very smooth sides all the way around. Back looks good. Got a little bit of indentation there, but it's no big deal. All right, there we go. I'll clean that up, guys. And we'll get that off to Silver Madness. Let me see how much that weighs real quick when I'm at it. Find out what I do with my scale. Scale, where are you? I don't know what I do with my scale. Let me see here. Oh, there it is. All right, guys, let's see what this bar weighs. Silver Madness. Turn that on. These are Troy ounce, by the way. Go. 2.2 ounces of silver for Silver Madness. Very cool. So I'll get that cleaned up. And we'll get that out to him. I'll show. Uh, I don't know if I'll combine the video into one, but I just wanted to show you guys this tonight. In the meantime, let's clean up this mess we got here. We got. I don't know what we got. We got a mess. We got these little chunkies, which we don't want to touch either. They're very, very hot. They will leave one heck of a burn mark on you. Still, like, just like that, sitting there. Get that little piece out of there. Oh, it's gonna fall down the crack. I move the brick sometimes and clean up the little chunks of silver out of there. There we go. Let's move that out of the way. So there we go, guys. We got a mess. Not enough silver to make even, well, we might have a one ounce bar there, but I wouldn't sell this bar anyway if I did. Let's see. 
Let's see what we pour in the last little bit here. I'll turn that on. Man, that thing's nasty. Wouldn't sell that to anybody. And one, one, almost 1.1 1 .1 ounces. But as you can see, that's ugly looking bar. We're gonna remelt that. Pretty nasty. Anyway, Silver Madness, there's your channel bar, my friend. We'll get that out to you as soon as I get it cleaned up. And uh, I didn't think we had enough for another two ounce bar, but I tried anyway. I thought we had enough silver in there, but no. Nope. Anyway, guys, maybe I'll melt this into a one ounce bar. Take that off. I do have some one ounce molds. Maybe I'll try that. All right, guys, thanks for watching. VC Coins Nevada. And you guys have a good night. Good morning, wherever you are in the world. And I will talk to you later. Thanks. All right, guys, we're back. I'm going to see if I have enough silver in here to melt the uh, maybe a one ounce silver round. Let's see what we come up with here. Yeah, we got enough silver in here to do that. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, look at that. Turn that off. Furnace is done for the night. Or this morning, I should say. I think that turned out pretty good. This isn't for anybody. I just figured, what the heck? We got enough silver in there. Let's try a uh, silver round. Actually, this would be the first silver uh, round that I've actually poured. They've all been bars. I have poured pirate rounds and uh, lions, or tigers and lions. Uh, actually, tiger rounds and, and uh, pirate head rounds. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, see what this baby looks like here in a second. Ooh, that turned out pretty good, actually. Come on, don't mess with me tonight. Don't mess with me tonight. There we go. We'll set that down there and let it cool off. And we'll put these away. I'll grab the, my handy dandy new tool. The silver cools off quick, just sitting there. Still feel the heat off these molds on my arm. All right, let's see what we got here. Actually, it turned out pretty darn cool. It's a little button. A little button round, as you can see. Cool. Got a little crap on top of it. That'll come off really easy. Very nice. Let's see what she weighs. Make this quick so I can end this video. Turn that on. I'm thinking it's probably about an ounce, I think. Let's see. Troy ounce, yeah. Ah, just point nine zero. A little short of an ounce. That's Troy ounce. Let's see what it should be. Regular ounce, probably gonna be one ounce. Let me tear that. There we go. Yep, one, let me see, close to it. 0 .999, 0 .991, regular ounce, and then we'll go back to Troy ounce. Zero that out. 0 .90, a little short of an ounce of silver right there. I'm going to keep that, though. Turn that off. Somebody might want this. Somebody wants this little button that I poured. I'm going to clean it up. I'm going to tumble that along with this uh, two ounce uh, channel bar for Silver Madness. And we'll see what they look like in the morning. How's that sound? All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good morning or a good night wherever you are in the world. I did that backwards just for Lake House Beach to make them mad. But anyway.
thanks guys for watching i'll get back to you and uh i'm gonna go ahead and upload this video and then uh make another video on the finished product okay have a good night good morning you know the routine hey guys vc coins nevada here uh just giving you a quick follow-up on the channel bars that i did last night for uh channel bar that i did for uh silver madness there it is it's all stamped out it's got VC coins on the front of it. It's got my uh, tombstone on the back of it. That turned out very cool. It's got the uh, weight right here. 2.20 ounce OZT. Very cool. Uh, it's got the 999 silver stamped on it right there. I don't know if you can see that or not and it's got bar number uh, 20 marked on it right there so silver madness that'll be going out to you on Monday hope you enjoy it turned out beautiful my friend uh, like I said it's a pretty hefty bar remember you guys I uh, poured that button bar here's that button bar I told you I poured last night all shined up and on the back of it, I did have room, room enough for it for my uh, uh, gravestone bar, or stamp, I'm sorry, my gravestone stamp. So there we go, guys. This is almost an ounce of silver, not quite. So if somebody needs, wants this, or needs it, <laughs> whatever it might be the case, uh, you can contact me via my email. And I'd be more than happy to sell this little uh, button bar to you if you like. Or button round, I should say. It's very cool, I think. So let me know if you're interested in that. Uh, I'll probably let this go for, oh, I don't know. Oh, it's usually $25 an ounce, so 20 bucks. Uh, shipping included, so... Just let me know if anybody's interested in that and uh, shoot me an email, all right? First come, first serve. I appreciate you guys watching. You guys have a good night. And I'm drinking my Beck's beer tonight, yes. <clears throat> you guys have a good night. Good morning, wherever you are in the world, and I will see you tomorrow. I got to work on Sunday, so I'll be home around 4.15. So... Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.